somebody on a cruise one time asked me a question at the table, if I could time travel, who would I like to spend time with? And that is a real good question. It's a good question to think of yourself. Who would you choose to be with? Well, pretend for a moment that you are a time traveler. And uh, this moment, pretend that you're there with Michelangelo by his side as he begins to turn a block of stone into a statue. It is amazing to see how this great artist will keep chipping away, never giving up until a magnificent statue of David or Moses finally emerges from the block of stone. Well, perhaps today you are working on your own block of stone, whatever that is. An idea, a goal, a dream that is slowly taking place. And like Michelangelo, you will not give up on creating something that you know will be beautiful, something magnificent. For God, you know, has given you the ability to create as well. You may or may not be able to produce a work of art. Your special ability may be in creating a cheerful atmosphere wherever you are. Or you may discover a way to feed the world so that no one goes hungry or your warm embrace may turn someone's tears into a smile. When you do that, you're a Michelangelo. You are literally traveling through your own time in your own world to create something magnificent. It says in Psalms 104, verse 30, when you send forth your spirit, they are created. Well, I pray that your spirit creates many wonderful things in your lifetime. And I pray that you discover your purpose in small and in large ways. And as you travel through your own time, that you realize your traveling has not been in vain. You have made a difference in the time and the nature of the universe.